Okay, so this is a video on, like, the steps, basically, of how I got my Cadillac Power Wheel to be a limo and driving. So, about a month ago, I was garage sailing and I bought Power Wheel for $20. I drug it home on a wagon, and yeah. Then I cut it in half, cut it in half, and ripped all the wiring out. Then me and my dad built a wood frame, and it sat for a couple weeks, because I had to work, then I started school. Then today, I'm like, you know what, screw it. Now I ripped, all, ripped the wheels off, and put the motors on it. Put new motors on it and mounted mounted all up again and we put a boat uh, battery on it and it wasn't enough power so we had to take my car battery out of the Polara and mounted two batteries on it so basically two car batteries onto the power wheel i had to roll around with the fire extinguisher because i didn't know it was going to happen so yeah, so I'm gonna make, this is start to finish what, to ha what happened with the power wheel. Now, this is when, just after I bought it and I was dragging it home. All right, well, I went garage shelling today and I added another car to my collection. I got Cadillac Escalade. No? It doesn't work, but look at this, got a radio, don't know if it works, got a key, came with a key, got a subwoofers, no battery, so I'm a chainsaw, put a chainsaw engine in it, wish me luck. So, obviously I didn't put a chainsaw motor on it. I just put regular electric motors for it. Then, the next day, I gutted it and cut it in half. Now, on with those clips. So, Project Hohada is a go again. So far, we've got the most of the interior gutted. About to snip this wire and pull everything out. So, all the electric electrical stuff will go. So, I'm gonna snip. I'm gonna snip it. Like that. And then... This is the part where my dad comes in. He had to help me build the frame. Because... Obviously, I didn't know what I was doing, and I thought a single 2x4 would hold it. It wouldn't. So my dad walked me through how to build it, and me and him both built the frame. Then I made a seat because I couldn't sit comfortably. My knees were on the dashboard if I wanted to sit there, so I, had to, I dropped the seat back probably a foot or two so I could sit comfortably. And I put a wet floor sign where the seat used to go. I'll put pictures up so you can see where the seat was. And, yeah. Then, after I did that, I painted it. And I let it sit for a while. Now, this is... As I just finished painting it and the paint was still drying. After that, I let it sit for a little bit, put the new motors on it, and yeah. The blue frame was a last minute decision. I think it turned out pretty good. I was going to do all black, but I ran out of black spray paint. So I found a random blue can and spray painted it blue. I think it looks pretty good. Let me know in the comments, but still. 
Now, after we built, we well, painted it, we put the motors on it, and today, my dad and his friend start wiring it up, because I don't know what I'm doing when it comes to wiring, and we wired it up. And then we put a car battery, just regular boat battery in it, well, the marine batteries, because it's made to be able to get recharged a lot other than car battery when it's not made to do that. So we put a car boat battery in it, sorry. A boat battery in it. It wasn't fast enough, so we put regular car battery in it for my Polara and ran two two batteries and it went decently quick. And that's all we've really done to it so far. So now what I need to do is I need to build a bed for it so people can sit in it sit in it or I can just haul things with it because might as well better than riding a bike around with a backpack I guess so yeah that's really all we've done to it other than that so far we've probably have 200 bucks into it ish probably like 250 like a battery was 100 wood another 100 Paint, probably 20 bucks, plus a truck, 20 bucks, so, and the tools I need to buy, so, that's another 20, 30 bucks, so, you do the math on that, so, yeah, it's came a long way in the past couple months, so, yep, that's probably gonna be the end of it, I'll just put a few more pictures of it, and I'll call it a day, so, bye. He's cruising though. I just looked it up on the old Wally World website. The truck, well, Cadillac, Power Wheel, new was like 300 bucks, 350 bucks, something like that. So, faster and cheaper, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I was probably just better off buying a new one, but. Yeah, it's experience, I guess. <laughs> well, now that's the end of the video. Okay, bye.